What's going on guys, so it's a Pops to the Blake here and uh, this is some more cars and to begin with we have this thing, a Ford Capri um, this is a, uh, from Corgi as you can see back here I think I pronounced it right and another cool thing about this is that the bonnet opens and you can see the engine um, I've just noticed the rear wheels don't really work, but I only bought it because it was a Ford Capri. Only cost me 50 pence, so happy days. Next up, we have a Matchbox MR Toyota MR2 pace car, as you can see here. Pretty nice, pretty cool. Honestly, I absolutely love the MR2s, they're yeah, really cool. In my personal opinion. Next up, well, I don't really know what this is, but it looks similar to a 2CV or something close to that in that general description. Next up, we have a Nissan 260Z 2 Plus 2. It's not 240Z, but close enough, even if it doesn't look the greatest, it looks good. So block that there for now. Next up we have a, our first Hot Wheels in this video, a Chevy Nomad, I believe that's pronounced as. Looks quite nice, probably quite old, even got a sunroof. Doesn't move unfortunately, but that's pretty cool. And last but not least, a second Hot Wheels is a uh, 1971 Brook Brook uh, Riviana, I believe it's pronounced. Uh, I think I butchered the name uh, quite terribly. But honestly, looking at this thing and the badge on the back, you'd think it'd be like a Chevy of some description or a Corvette. But honestly, this does look fairly nice. So, there's the uh, set. Paid no more than, what, uh, two, three pound for it. So, happy days. Absolute bargain. Very nice. Saying that you'd only get one in a box out of... Toyland or any other shop or even as the for two pound two ten per a car. So happy days. And yeah, may not they may not be some of the rarest or even the most fancy, but oh well. And if you did enjoy the content, consider liking and subscribing. I'll see you guys all next time.